In this challenge, we will be taking down the Fighting Dojo in 5 minutes or less because... Newsflash, the Fighting Dojo sucks! And they put their gym, of all places, next to Sabrina's gym, which would annihilate them. Psyche against fighting type. Know your enemy. Rule one of fighting. Or just one of the major rules. So we will be whooping them with our Butterfree, which has Psybeam, and then with our Fero, which has Drill Peck. Simple as that. So, come on, Black Belts. And come on, how you gonna be next to Sabrina's gym when she's got level 50 Pokemon and her trainers have, you know, high 30s? It is laughable how you think you can build a gym next to the sixth gym leader in the entire region of Kanto. Your Pokemon black belts are in the 30s. It's just it's just comical how you think you stand a chance against these trainers rolling through. Oh yeah, before I get my, you know, uh, Marsh badge from Sabrina, what's this? This says gym on it. Let me stop in here. Oh wait, all you have is like some weak Machops, Primates, Mankeys, Machokes, and then your your Karate Master has a decent Hitmonlee and Hitmonchan, like level 37, really? You already know any trainer on their quest is already going to be well in the 40s, or at least they should be. And oh, of course we're going to take a free prize Pokemon. I mean, not that it matters because it's only at level 30. You know, I'm all I'm well into the 40s, so if I wanted to, I could train it up. But come on, like, I don't know. To me, the only Pokemon fighting type worth having in Gen 1 would be Machamp. Like, Machamp is a beast. Why do I not see any Machamps in this fighting dojo? Why, why are you going to stop at Machoke? Why not just get a Machamp and just... Why do I have to wait until Bruno in the Elite Four to see a Machamp? Like, seriously, level 31 Machop in the beginning? And then, uh... A level 31 man key from one of these black belts? Dude, I could have saw that in like the fourth gym. No, 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 even the third gym. Lieutenant Surge's Raichu is at like what? Level 29 or something? That Raichu would destroy this man key and doesn't even have type advantage. Give me something. Come on, man, give me a challenge. You know, I love doing these challenges on YouTube. Show me something. The only thing that I would trust the Fighting Dojo to do if they were on my side is to take down the trainers on Nugget Bridge, which is in Sirland City at Misty's Gym, which is the second gym, by the way. I mean, y'all probably know that. Because this Fighting Dojo is, they're just getting swept, swept up, cleaned up. This is too easy. Like, they... They could handle, they could handle Nugget, Nugget Bridge. I'll give them that. But anything else, nah. This is just, this is just too funny. It's too easy. And I'm thinking about it. Is there a fighting and flying type Pokemon in the entire Pokédex up and up through Sun and Moon? Cause uh, I can't think of one. I was just on. I'm on a tangent here because. Flying type would would still be super effective against it because flying against flying is normal damage, but flying against fighting is super effective, obviously. And it would be weak to electric type and rock. Well, I guess it'd be. Is rock not very effective on fighting type? Because if it's not, then it's super effective on flying, so it would just equal out to normal damage. But fighting and flying type. Ah, uh, whatever. I'll just I'll just stay away from that type. 